Well, welcome home cooks to the AI kitchen. I am uh, Chef Kevin, and it's good to be joined here by Chef David. Welcome. Good to see you, Chef, and good to see you viewers. So, okay, so for all the home cooks watching this, I'm gonna try to really quickly go through this new uh, channel agent. This is called, I'm gonna call this recipe the slow cooker channel agent, because you once you set it up, it's like a slow cooker recipe. You can go off to work and when you come home, it's it basically has is, is done the cooking for you. So, okay, so I'm, let's share my screen. Uh, this is really new, it's the channel agent. The deal is, uh, so you got a channel. So here I got this channel called articles. You go in, it's a little confusing because this is Microsoft. You go in, you say you wanna add a, an agent to this channel. It basically does that. You'll see here, it calls it. It's a little confusing because whatever the channel name is, this is the articles. By using the articles agent, well, the reason it gets that name is because that's the channel name. The coolest one you can create is create a channel called Secret, and then you have a secret agent. Secret agent. <laughs> there you go, which, I, which I've actually done. So anyway, so you can basically add this here. Uh, whoops, I'm clicking on the wrong screen, as I always do. So you can basically add this, and it will go and what what this channel agent is, is going to do is for this particular channel every by default every week it's going to create a status report that it's going to send to you or any other people that you deem as reviewers and then you can basically review it edit it and click a button and then it'll share it back with the channel um so it sets up this work uh so here it's doing this and now I can't cancel it. Let's see, okay, we can cancel it. So what it does is, for instance, it creates this uh, kind of a private group for any reviewers. It creates this status report. Uh, you can go into it and you can, for example, say how often, by default it's weekly. You can say a daily, a daily status report, monthly, whatever. Um, and once again, when it runs, it creates the, re the results and you can then go and edit it and you can add as many reviewers as you want. And then basically you can click a button and it sends it as a loop component because of course Microsoft wants to use loop components. But the reason it's like a slow cooker recipe is it really is set and forget. And so for now every week in this particular you know, channel, I'll get a message saying, hey, you got the status report and then you can send it to the other people in channel when you're happy. So that that is the new nice. channel agent. Um, and yeah, try try out that recipe if you're using Microsoft Teams and let me know what you think. I think it's a little confusing, but it is relatively new and Microsoft will probably tweak it over time. Yeah, it, it needs to be cleaned up a little bit, but the concept makes sense. I mean, as, as a heavy Discord user, you know, anyone who uses Discord knows how, how powerful bots are. And I'm, I'm not talking about AI bots, I'm talking about dumb bots that, that do <laughs> repetitive tasks like that. Uh, we've been using them for years, and I've been like, why isn't business chat copying Discord more with this kind of stuff? And this is that kind of a thing, but it's, it is AI. It's not just a dumb bot. It is doing an AI thing. Uh, but with that, yeah, with that bot in the chat, a workflow that we're all used to so or, or at least us young people are used to i don't know you know you old people don't know what discord is uh so i'm i am i'm behind this workflow yeah i want to see i want to see it get cleaned up a little bit but uh it, there are going to be a lot of agents in a lot of our chats it's just the way it's going to happen yeah and if you're lucky you'll have a secret agent absolutely <laughs> nice one chef kevin all right thanks everyone for watching we'll see you in the next recipe take care